This is a 65-year-old male with fever and altered mental status. There are numerous sites of abnormal T2 flare hyperintense foci within the subcortical white matter of the right and left frontal parietal regions. The abnormal signal intensity extends inferiorly to involve the insular and subinsular regions with additional involvement of the mesial temporal lobes. There is involvement of the posterior aspects of the gyrus recti and orbitofrontal gyri best demonstrated on the ADC maps. There was no definite suspicious post-contrast enhancement at the time of imaging. The patient underwent lumbar puncture with CSF fluid analysis and received the final diagnosis of herpes encephalitis. Herpes encephalitis is an infection most commonly caused by herpes simplex virus type 1. Imaging features usually include T2 flare hyperintensities within the limbic system. Lesions are associated with decreased diffusivity. The disease is typically bilateral but asymmetric. The deep great nuclei of the basal ganglia are usually spared. The differential diagnosis includes ischemia or infarct, status epilepticus, limbic encephalitis, and infiltrating neoplasm.